Hello guys, welcome back to Mufasuket with Fusion 3D Sket Modeling Practice Exercise Number Six, and also don't forget to subscribe our channel here. It will be helpful for us to growing up. In this uh, tutorial, I will create a 3D wooden toolbox. You can see the image here, and you can get this uh, reference image from our site Mufasuket.com. We start now. Open your uh, Fusion software. First, I will create a circle in the front plane here from uh, this point to here with uh, dimension about 20 and I will create a line from uh, this uh, point to the bottom here create a line again from here to the right here okay next I will give a uh, distance from uh, this point to this uh, center point in here about 25 I will give a uh, dimension for uh, this uh, line about 30 and we create a circle with a tangent you can click uh, this line and this line with a radius about 20 and enter we create a line again from uh, this point to the bottom here about 50 point and we create a line from uh, this point to here and ok right click and ok again Use a trim command to cut uh, this uh, line object and then we cut uh, this circle. I will create a line from uh, this point to the bottom here. Okay, right click, okay, select uh, this uh, line object, right click and change to the construction line here. With a trim command, we cut uh, this uh, circle object. Okay, you can see the result. Click here, sketch and uh, file it select uh, this object and this object we file it with uh, five point and okay and then i will uh, copy this uh, object by using a mirror command you can click here sketch and uh, mirror select uh, this object you can select uh, this object uh, one by one okay for the mirror line select uh, this uh, construction line you can see the result here and ok we extrude uh, this uh, face with uh, distance about 5 and ok next I will create line in uh, this face from uh, here to the top here about 50 ok and then line again from here to the right here about 5 and ok we create a circle with uh, 2 point here you can click uh, from here to the top here with uh, dimension about 40 and ok next I will create a line from here and connect to here ok you can use uh, trim command to cut uh, this uh, circle and right click and ok I will use uh, file command again here and you can select here file it. you select uh, this object and this object file it with a radius about 5 and ok we extrude uh, this face you can uh, use uh, orbit command to rotate uh, the drawing with uh, distance here about 100 and ok I uh, will uh, move uh, this uh, object you can tap uh, M to move and select uh, this object ok you can select uh, this object and move uh, to the Z axis here ok and then ok Next, I will uh, mirror again. You can click here, uh, create and uh, mirror. Select uh, this uh, object. And for a mirror plan, I will select uh, this plan. And okay, I will move again uh, this object to here. And next, I will uh, click uh, okay here use uh, mirror command again you can click here create and uh, mirror and then select uh, this uh, object you can select uh, this uh, object and for uh, mirror plane I will select uh, this plane and ok and next I will move uh, this uh, object by using uh, legion 
you can click here modify and legion select uh, this point and this point next remove uh, this object uh, from uh, this point to this point and then i will move uh, this object from uh, this point to this uh, point and you can see the result here i will click here ok and you can create a rectangle from uh, this face from uh, here to here and then we extrude uh, this uh, rectangle face to the top here about uh, minus 5 and ok and you can see and for the last we create a circle in uh, this face you can select uh, this uh, center point with uh, dimension about 12 and ok and we extrude uh, this uh, circle to here about 100 and ok ok we create a 3d wooden toolbox you also can use a pilot command to pilot uh, this uh, edge with uh, radius about 1 and ok and we pilot again this uh, edge with the radius about 1 and ok next we will apply a material to the object you can click here on model and go to the render tab I will click this uh, appearance and select a uh, wood uh, material here you can select a uh, walk here and drag uh, to the object here and close I will uh, zoom out the object and uh, rotate to get uh, the base uh, view next I will uh, setting up the scan setting here and increase the brightness or decrease okay you can see and we also can use uh, each pressure here to uh, make uh, the best view for the rendering okay we'll increase the brightness here again okay next we try to render you can click here and click in canvas render okay you can see the result here we'll, I will close uh, this uh, scan setting and you can get uh, the best uh, rendering views it's a uh, minimum about 120 seconds or uh, 2 minutes I think it's enough today for uh, Fusion 3D Sketch uh, Modeling Practice Exercise number 6. If you have any question, you can comment below this video. And see you next time in uh, Fusion 3D Sketch Modeling Practice Exercise number 7.